Hey guys, welcome. Welcome to Medieval. Um, so. In a time long ago, there lived in the kingdom of Galomir a sorcerer named Zerok. This arrogant, pitiless man hated his fellow citizens for their simple and peaceful ways. So he raised an army of demons and set out to take the realm for his own. The king's champion, Sir Daniel Fortescue, led the militia in the battle against this unholy horde. Songs are still sung of how he spearheaded the charge deep into the accursed multitude. How demons fell before him like wheat before the scythe. And how at last, though mortally wounded, he destroyed the sorcerer utterly. Fortescue went down in history that day as the hero of Galamir, and a time of peace began, which was to last for a hundred years. And then the sorcerer returned. All right, folks, so uh, that's your plot. Hey, Jasm, how's it going? Welcome in. <laughs> Yeah, this is the Halloween special, uh, but probably not the, the, the scariest game of all, but I feel like um, it, it's Halloween, so why not? Yeah, because this came out in 2019, right? Um, I, I really enjoyed this back on the PS1, um, so... Yeah, I'm looking forward to, to replaying it. It's um, I, I don't think I ever completed it on PS1 without uh, cheats. Uh, I, I recall there was a cheat that could unlock all the chalices and stuff. Um, oh yeah, of course it had a PSP remake. Um,
Hey, Blue is Fiends. Uh, and yeah, glad to hear you're doing well, Jasmine. Um, nice to hear you came across an affectionate chat. Meow. <laughs> oh, that's me being an affectionate chat. Yeah, the, it, we managed to get Mario all done and dusted. Uh, I think when, when we get back to. Hey, Bate's there, how's it going? Uh, <laughs> Jeff can be my affectionate cat, and you can be my affectionate chat. Um, yeah, uh, I think we'll, we'll do the Zero series, so then we might do um, potentially some more retro variety before delving into the Battle Network series. Um, yeah, I hope you guys are doing good. Uh, in Bad taste bear. Oh, um, yeah, bear with me. Uh, down a tad. Right, so that be. Uh, the PS4 is a bit silly in that. Um, I guess you can keep speech volume up. Um, in, in that, you can't sort of do the volume from. So, is, is that any better? Or, or does it. There is, in fact, a bear with There is. Uh, let me know if it needs to turn in up or down. I'll um, await your input. Maybe a notch more. Okie dokie. Oopsie daisy. Oops. Uh, don't know whether I notched it up higher or lower. Do it a notch down. Again, I, I, I'll just get the volume settings out of the way now. Yeah, but it's quite good actually, Jasm, because uh, I know Final Fantasy VIII and a, a couple of the games don't have um, volume control, which can be rather a bit of a kerfuffle. But um, yeah, and how's it going, Ashua? How's it going, Bad Taste Bear? Mega Man Legacy Collections. <laughs> okay. Um, hopefully this is okay. I'm sure we can change it throughout the game. Uh, let's get into it. Uh, so yeah, as, as I was saying, uh, this is a game that I played quite a bit as a kid. It used to creep me out a bit actually, but I guess what can I, it's more cartoony than anything. Yeah, we did Mega Man. Uh, 11. I, I actually had you on, uh, on one of the Mega Man 11 streams. Uh, funnily enough, you play guitar. <laughs> Fire! <laughs> oh, look at his smile. <laughs> no, that's fair enough. It was some time ago. Um, so. Yeah. Well, so, you know. It has risen again. Sir Daniel Fortescue. See? The hero of Galomir who fell at the first charge. The fog of war and the shrouds of time conspire to turn the arrow fodder into the savior of the day. But we knows better. <laughs> Let it alone. Fate has given it a second chance. A chance to forget the ignoble truth. A chance to defeat Serac and live up to the legend. We hope it does well. Thank you, Mr. Gargoyle. <laughs> yeah, so uh, that, that's something I always remember, those um, gargoyles. Um... Don't think I want to speak to him again. 
cheeky bit of explanation. <sighs> okay. Uh, I'm not sure whether I'm going to want to go inverted or not. <laughs> Money, money, money. Hello. Any treasure that you find will be added to your coin total. Coins are used to buy items from the greedy merchant gargoyles. Yeah, this is a remake, a uh, bear, and a booty. Um, you must be out of shape after 100 years lying on your back. Yeah, uh, it's, I think it's released in 2019 uh, for PS4 and possibly some of the others. Uh, interestingly enough, uh, whether I 100% this or not, um, I'm not sure yet, but um, you can actually unlock the original PS1 version if you do get 100%. When you're ready to leave this crypt, you'll find an exit at the end of the hall. To unlock the gates, you must find a rune stone and place it in the ornate hand set next to the doorway. Thank you, Miss Book. Yeah, I, I really enjoyed this back on PS1. As I said, I don't think I beat it legitimately, um, but um, yeah, I have great memories of um, Niku. How's it going, dude? Welcome coming in. Hope you're doing good today. And yeah, if if anybody needs me to hold a hand, Some if you get too scared, powers and let abilities me know. beyond the ordinary. Be sure to test every weapon to discover their secondary abilities. Some weapon abilities are immediate, and some may need a bit of time to charge before they realize their full potential. Need you to hold my hand like a slob cop. You know what? On the PS4 chat, I can't see that hideous emote. <laughs> so, you can use it as much as you want. Woohoo, got a shield. And a sword. Hey, like your travels through Galamir, you will collect many items. To see your items or to use one, review no your inventory. In it, you will also find back. your book of Galamir, <laughs> which will keep well the today, like of the back. denizens you've encountered, and bestow you with keen insights that only a disembodied voice could provide. Mm -hmm. Oh, so yeah. It's not got a second hat. Gang, gang. Uh, and yeah, um, if you're not following Niku, definitely check him out. If you're not following Lacabra as well, you will not regret it. You're washing clothes today. Nice. Uh, can I send you over my uh, clothes? <laughs> not to wash, just to smell. Um, sorry, that sounded a bit weird. Uh, I take that back. And yeah, enjoy the, the lurky twerks. Lacabra. Touched book the this time. Oh no, I wanted to speak to that book. Oh well. Probably didn't have anything interesting to say anyway. Cherry Mandarin. <laughs> I'm a pacemaker, right? Okay, let's check out this graveyard. That's actually my, um, oh, uh, definition, <laughs> sorry, uh, yeah, um, let me get that definition for you. Uh, definition of gerrymandering is to manipulate the boundaries of an electrical, uh, electoral, sorry, constituency, so it's to favour one party or class. There you go. Um, what was I going to say, yeah, graveyard is actually my, um, please don't mind the jerry. Uh, Graveyard's actually my, uh, my spooky name. And yeah, Java Alert's cooking. Hey, cheers for popping by. Have a good one. Sadly, just drinking coffee. Alright. Let's dive into it.
Papa, don't preach. Okay. <coughs> Oh, look at those trees. Oh, is that hand useless? Hey, Techno Odin. Sir Daniel Porter School. <laughs> Hope you're doing well today. And yeah, if you're not from Techno, doing some God of War, definitely check him out. Yeah, welcome to um, Medieval. Today we'll be getting rid of some zombies. Welcome back to your beloved Galamir. The stinking dead have risen up to dance with the lifeless living. And they want to do it over your dead body. Mm. Hey Mountain Dew. Hope you're doing well today. Me! Hey, Kiwi. Hope you're doing well today, too. Okay, if you're not playing Mountain Dew, do some uh, Disney Dreamlight Valley. We've got Kiwi on the Visage as well. Hope you're both doing good today. Okay, I hear zombies. I see zombies. I had to find out which button it is to um, raise my shield. Uh, and yeah, I'm doing good, thank you. Oh, there we go. I won. <laughs> yeah, I'm. Uh, oh, work was alright. Um, pretty tired, though. I was pretty tired last night as well. But. Um, oh, well, it's been pretty chill. That small light following you around is a wisp. The heroes of the hall are not supposed to intervene in mortal affairs. But when they heard that Sir Daniel Fortescue had a shot at redemption, well, they decided to give you a hand with your depth perception. He will circle enemies, helping you direct your ranged attacks. But he'll also let you know what things might merit a closer look. Right, well, thank you, Wispy. See that treasure might merit a closer look for me. Oh, well. We got that airfield. Get rid of that fella. Didn't mean to uh, want to fit with knife. Oh yeah, that's the life bottle, isn't it? So fairy from tells only better because he doesn't touch. Hey, Don't hey. let zombies get you down. Tend those wounds by stepping into this fountain of rejuvenation. Oh, it should be so uh, totally a uh, nappy. Um, mod for this. <laughs> hey, listen. <laughs> I'd, I'd buy it. Well, I probably wouldn't, but... Sometimes it may be useful to view the world from a different point of view. Be sure to take a moment from time to time to enjoy the beauty of our beloved Galamere. Keep your eye peeled for anything interesting. Thank you, book. Hold LT for Dankam. Awesome. Yeah, so that then heals up. Um, I think we're all right for now. We'll, we'll come back to it later. Uh, later might be now, by the way. <laughs> Sorry to ever doubt you. Oh wait, do I have that life bottle? Or is that already charged?
Remember, nothing remains hidden under the gaze of an angel. Thank you. That's good because I'm loving angels instead. I think I can go just use it once in a while. So let's see, Angel. Um. Do I think that's the end? Okay. Sorry, I just thought I'd have a little bit of an explore. The object here is the chalice. Every time you dispatch an enemy with a soul, the chalice fills a little more. Fill the chalice and then collect it, and you will be worthy of visiting the sacred Hall of Heroes to claim a new weapon. There is a chalice to be found in every region of Galamere. They are all hidden or well guarded. Only a true hero will collect the full set. Yeah, um, I, I don't know if we'll be a hundred percent in medieval, um, but we we'll certainly give it a good go. Oops, too busy. The living world lies beyond these skull gates. The master of the hilltop mausoleum, the stained glass demon, has possession of the skull key. Okay, do you remember that? Hope I've not accidentally ended up going the correct way. <laughs> um, we'll, we'll, we'll check down these stairs anyway. Just my way. Oh, nice. Got the chalice awarded. We'll go back for that after. Um, to check this uh, spot out. Uh, but yeah, I think most of the levels have a little chalice um, hidden in them. Um, and who knows? Uh, you could always just go for the, all of the chalices. Let's say the one of um, those healing points. <laughs> yeah, could I jump over there, do you reckon? Oh, I can walk over there. <laughs> Feel free to have a paddle in the shallow water, but don't be tempted to go for a swim. Buoyancy can be a problem for those of a dead disposition. Yeah, no, that's really cool, Jasmine. Um, as I say, I think it's a hundred percent, a hundred percent award. Um, let's see, baby. But yeah, it, it's nice that it has it. Um, but it's got chime in it. Yeah, I, I can't think of any other. Uh, remake that has it because uh, I think the Spyro has the original music right um, but not the original um, what do you call it uh, the, the original uh, game Let's see if there's anything sneaky up here. Oh, did Zool have it? Ah, oh, okay. Get our prize. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, 
right, so was this just treasure? <laughs> I thought this was the right way to go. I mean, I guess we can jump down here, right? But still. I think I might have just wasted everybody's time. There you go. Hello. Um. I feel like most of the throwing daggers that I've bought have, um, uh, that I've wasted have just been from me accidentally throwing them. Uh, it came with a Mega Drive version, uh, but I thought you loved Zero. Like everybody loves Zero. I love Zero. See Daisy. Okay, let's try not to, uh, drown. Oh. Hello. Are you going to try and catch me? What? Zarek awaits beyond these gates. The master meets with the demon from the mausoleum. Hatching plots of purest evil. Forgotten nobodies would be wise to make themselves scarce. Alright, um... Yeah, I, I, I don't think that, um... That was a congratulations. Okay. Um, yeah, but the soundtrack's really good, isn't it? Oh, this is the Hall of Heroes, Welcome of course. Welcome to the Hall of Heroes, where the bravest warriors from history spend eternity feasting, singing, and arm wrestling. If they think you're worthy enough, you may be able to persuade them to give you a new weapon. Hopefully we're worthy enough. Oh. <laughs> it's just something of shit. To pay homage to the heroes, stand in front of their designated statues and await spiritual guidance. <laughs> Guide me spiritually. Captain Fortescue, it's me, Canny Tim. Does the battle go well? <laughs> How I wish I could fight at your side again, sir. But hold, you could take my crossbow. It's got rapid fire and it can ricochet the darts off walls to shoot around corners. I used it at the Battle of Galamir. After you were slain, I shot Zarek's champion, Lord Kada, a clean kill through the eye at some thousand yards. <laughs> Not that there's anything <laughs> clever about shooting someone in the eye, sir. Oh. Goodbye, sir. Just give me my bow. <laughs> Thank you. Um, okay, awesome. Yeah, maybe one day we too can become a legendary hero, but until that day, um, you know, we'll settle for being a, a zero. Okay, on to the uh, next level. You're really good at arm wrestling, Jasmine. And, uh, Cemetery Hill. So I remember this level. Uh, I think this one had the um, boulders in it, right? Install it? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> well, I thought I installed this game. <laughs> um. Ah, oh, it's 96 minutes left. <laughs> 97. 
Ja. Um. <laughs> New DLC levels. I, uh, I, I, so, so apparently, because I, I, I installed it last night, but I guess I didn't install it all. Um. <laughs> that I don't think we could wait ninety minutes with me not doing anything. Ugh, what a kerfuffle. Um yeah, sorry about that guys. Um do, 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 do. Trying to think what we could possibly do. Uh, I could just call it early on and just wait for it to download and then we could try more of it next week. Uh, I was hoping to get a couple of hours done of this though. Um, but that's okay. <laughs> yeah, this is it. Uh, I'd have to get the laptop out for that, uh, the gaming laptop. Um, Uh, I think it'll auto save, won't it? Let's see if there's anything else that we could show up on here. Detect no, uh, you know what? It's my own fault. I, I think I've been caught by this before with other games as well. Where, um,. Let me see whether we've got anything on my... Okay, um... Yeah, I, I think anything else that I could reasonably do, um... Hey Peds, hey Alexa. Uh, I'm sorry, unfortunately, um, I, I didn't install all of this game, so I've, I've literally got to... I didn't mean to do new game. Um, okay, let's quit out of this. Uh, so I think we might have to call it here, folks. Uh, that's okay. I didn't mean to restart. Hopefully I've not just auto-saved over my auto-save. <laughs> uh, Pets, I, I tried doing it, hey, Vinny. Hey, Pets, hey, uh, Alexa. It no, it's, it's, um, quit to, yeah. Um, yeah, because I thought I installed it last night, but... Um, let's exit this. Kill that game. I know, I was thinking what else I could do quickly. Um. Oh, okay. I, I think I, I remember playing this back on PS1. Um. Kill a penguin. Well, first of all, I'm just hoping that I've not. Um. Okay, good. So we've got that save data still. Um, do, 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 do. Yeah. Uh, okay. Bear with me. Might have an idea. It's not to wait for. I'm not pouting, not pouting, um, not pouting, um, but yeah, um, uh, it's gonna be a good idea. I'm not a pout yet. Um,
Yeah, I, I think we'll, we'll call it here and um, we'll, we'll be on next week. Uh, and I'll, I'll make sure that's installed. It did say that it'd take 90 minutes. Um, but yeah, <laughs> no problem. Uh, sorry that we only got two levels done. But hopefully um, next week it'll be fully installed. Uh, there will be a stream tomorrow um, around this time. Uh, we'll be doing lost levels tomorrow because it won't be about on Friday. Um, just to play something else. I'd have to reset stream anyway. And um, the only things I've really got installed on PS4 at the moment is Wipeout and Mega Man X. Um, so I'd have to probably download another game. Um, that's fine. Uh, we can join Ed Rivando. I've never had the opportunity to, to raid him. And um, he's doing some Fable too. He's a really chill dude. Uh, and we'll, we'll be doing last levels tomorrow. Um, so raid message can be uh, whatever you want it to be. And I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Alright. Team Mega Man X, not last levels. Play Mega Man. I uh, could do. I am an idiot. Yeah, I, I guess the problem with Mega Man is I'd still have to. Yeah, that, that can be the raid message. I'd still have to restart the stream in any event. Because um, uh, I was thinking. I, I, was, I was actually thinking whether I had uh, Crash Team Racing installed, but I don't. Alright. Um, yeah, catch you guys next time. Goodbye, everybody. Um, and for those still hanging about, cheers, guys. Sorry that the game's not downloaded. But yeah, we'll try and sort it for next time. Goodbye. Um, oh. <laughs> now we say goodbye. All right, catch you later, guys. Bye.